All right, now right, to introduce right, the players. That harder. <laughs> That's gonna be online. Um, this is Dave. Say hi to the folks, Dave. What's up? <laughs> He's in his moment right now, getting his Eldar list ready, so that way my space pooses can nibble on his ankles and piss him off royally. That's his army back there. I'm not going to explain all the details. I'm going to have that listed under show more info so that way you don't have to sit through 15 minutes of me explaining everything. All right, this is my army, aside from the giant dice and the giant tape roller and the book that's flayed out. Got a bunch of space wolves, some mountain rhinos in the tree lines, a uh, squad of long fangs up there with a lot of support. And the rest of my army will be coming in reserves. All right, all right, just a recap of deployment. This is Dave's army. Everything's stretched out against the back side of the board. He's probably going to try and get right up in my face, so I got to do some hard hitting first turn, unless he steals the initiative, in which case I'm kind of screwed. All right, this is all my guys lined up and ready to rock. I got scouts right up there in that tree base. They do their scout and infiltrator thing together. And we're going to go ahead and start turn one. After we see if Dave rolls to steal the initiative on a six. Does he do it? That's a big fat no. Almost a one. All right. All right, so first turn shooting space wolves. What happened, Dave? Uh, four space elves got royally screwed. <laughs> Did they, in fact, get so screwed that they dookied in their pants? Not quite. Okay. Not quite. All right, so they're almost still in this game. Yes. All right. <laughs> All right. Space Wolves couldn't do anything because of night fighting, which really sucks balls on this long of a table with this setup. Yeah, All right, Dave, let's see what happened. All right, so everybody kind of moved up. 18, 18, 18 all the way across. And let us know if we do anything wrong because this is our first bat rep. Um, they fired a shit ton. The Wraith Lord back there, the Overlord who shouldn't fire, he got killed off by the uh, blast template from the Whirlwind earlier because he only had the one wound and we didn't know that. And um, the tank back there and the Wraith Lord fired into my squad of scouts. All right, so recap on Space Wolves turn two. Um, that Rhino moved up. These guys passed the Tempest Wrath. This guy stayed put. This guy was destroyed. These guys stayed put and benefited from the cover. These guys moved up, shot a little bit, didn't have range. There was a bunch of uh, scouts over there. There's only one left. He won combat, though, and that was in a wolf guard, so he's, he's good. There's a bunch of scouts back there, if I can get them. Yeah, just barely. With this angle, I have to keep the camera attached to the charger, so that's all good. Those guys are back there with the wolf priest, and they benefit from a... Three plus cover save. Because they have stealth, which is awesome. The outflank termies didn't come in, so let's see what happens in turn three of Eldar. Alright, Dave, so give us a recap. What happened during your movement shooting and assault? Alright, everything moved up. That way I can get my jink saves. Bam, bam, Work bam, spiders bam. came in. They shot at the squad on top of the busted ass rhino. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta rub that in, huh? <laughs> Alright. Alright. Dire Avengers moved into cover. That way they don't get shot. Right up there. <laughs> behind that tank. All right. That way, coming up here soon, they can take the uh, asset. Gotcha. Dark Reapers are staying just out of range till night fight goes away. Those guys all the way over. Yeah. All the tanks shot. Couple people died. Not much, sadly. All right. Got lucky with all those damn saves. That's right, damn it. Space Wolves live on to fight another day. All right, here we go. Recap, turn three, Space Wolves. Let's see what's left on the board. Still a, quite a bit, quite a bit is left, and we are looking at going into turn three for the Eldar. Now let's find out. Space Marine Terminator, Space Wolf, Wolf Guard, dropped in, shot a whole lot, one wound, no deaths. So that squad is still able to rip the shit out of people. But we did pin the squad in there that could have contested the objective, so that's a benefit for us. These guys moved up, but as you can see, they're hiding still. I can actually get a decent shot, but not good enough. So these guys are all close combat, so they're just, they're just going to sit back there and wait until something happens. And um, that's it for Space Wolves. What did we take out, Dave? 
All right, three Dire Avengers dead, and uh, four Fire Dragons and a Wave Serpent. All right. Damn explosions. Damn them. <laughs> and we also took out Warp Spiders. Ah, oh, that's true. Which we're chilling right here. We unloaded hell into them because we didn't like the way they were shooting at our buddies. Two full units to take them down. Two full units, but we <laughs> took them. We took them out. <laughs> So much for acute senses during night fight. All right, let's go, guys. Next way, next phase, turn three for the Eldar. All right, Dave, so a recap. What happened during Eldar turn three? I forgot shit and didn't get to shoot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, but what did happen? All right, let's see. Dark Reapers, both units. One unit took out a small chunk of the long fangs. Causing them to go to ground. They are now pwned for a while. <laughs> Turbies decided to come in and play, you know, Mary Hob and didn't do so well. Didn't do very well at all. There's only one left. And they had involves. Dark Reapers, baby. Dark Reapers. <laughs> Everything else moved up and is moving for a kill. Alright, so we're going into Space Wolves turn three. <laughs> Let's right. Or turn four. Turn four. Space Wolves turn four. Let's see what happens. I love this fucking game. So much fun. Um, no units died over here, thankfully. This guy moved up a whole lot, though. This guy moved up over here. It was just within 24. It took a dangerous terrain test. No failures there. This guy moved up. No dozer blade problems. He made a save. Um, you know, on anything but a one. These guys actually got shot up a whole lot. There's only two left, but that was at the end of my turn. So anyways, they moved up into cover. Now they get a cover save. So let's see what happens going into Space Wolves turn four. Recap, Space Wolves turn four, shooting. These guys shot, did nothing with their assault cannon over here. These guys didn't shoot at all because they couldn't do anything. This guy shot, scattered off the board again for the second time. These guys came up. I actually got to roll that real quick. Could you pass me two of my dice? Yeah, they're fine. Leadership 10. All right, they came up from the ground. They're good to go until the end of the next shooting phase, which they're probably going to get laid into a lot. These guys moved up, did some damage slightly, wiped out a squad, controlling objective. So that's good for them. These guys moved up, ran up. They couldn't do nothing. These, I had a Terminator over here who was a wolf guard, and I had another wolf guard model who was an individual, and he tried to charge. They both succeeded to charge, but got killed by cracked missiles from a snapshot, which is insanely crazy. And these guys just moved up, didn't really do much. We're going to go ahead into Eldar turn four. Here we go. Okay, so a recap on Eldar turn four. Let's see what you got, Dave. All right, Eldrad and the Farseer unit, or uh, Warlock These guys unit. right here, badasses. Dismounted. Completely badasses. And attacked the crap out of this squad here. Which only managed to kill two, luckily. Two. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Flame templates are a bitch from the Eldrad, especially when you got your guy right there. All right. What do you got to say about that? Fuck you. Space Marines lived to fight another day. They won't live much longer. <laughs> All right. Okay. Eldar tanks shot on squads and the whirlwind. Finally, getting to take out the whirlwind. This guy lasted four turns and took out one full squad almost. Almost. But he did his points value. He did his points value, Following so I'm okay that, with that. Swooping Hawks came in, dropped a grenade pack, did nothing. On oh, this squad over here is scattered completely away, did nothing. By the way, they came in and mishapped, so I got to place them all the way over Nyanda. Right over Nya by the giant skull world tape. <laughs> and then the Dark Reapers managed to finally kill off rape. All of the Long Fangs. They did. They killed everyone, including the Warlord, which will be a victory point for him. All right. End of Eldar, turn four. Let's go into turn five. Dark Reapers! Woo! 